Hello guys, welcome to episode 5 of the Men of War series. Um, today we're going to be working with the while command uh, as well as the switch command. And we're going to be creating uh, some sort of ambient um, gun firing. So, for, for an example, it's probably easy if I show you. The gun's going to rotate. There are three waypoints. And it's going to pick. It's a random. It'll pick one. And it's going to fire. So you can hear other ones in the background. I've got five set up so far. And then we'll start to set up the sixth one for the tutorial. It's pretty cool. Um, very good if you want to do a cinematic scene. So, yeah, let's get stuck into it. It's pretty short, um, so shouldn't take long to, to do. Uh, you'll also be working with offsets within the waypoints, so I'll be showing you that as well. Let's get started. So we're going to need some German soldiers. Um, and I'm pretty sure for this I just used the... The normal ones here, um, it doesn't say, that's cool, no worries. Um, I like the helmets ones. Okay. What we're going to do is just really quickly drop the helmet down. And get one of these 1940s Germans to pick it up. And we want to ensure they're on the green side, the yellow side, sorry, which is the enemy. Um, not D, uh, we want one. Okay. So we've got the, the three guys that will be manning the gun. Let's go back to the cannon and we'll go and get the flak gun, 38 here. Paste it that way. Put on hold, and we want the obviously the, the winter texture um, because we're in a winter environment. So get these on on the gun. Now, um, you can put two. Usually, if they get attacked by the enemy, the third guy, this one here, will jump off. Um, so yay underscore gun underscore six which is the tag I'm giving it, so your tag will vary depending on what you want to call it. Alright, so then we get into the waypoints. Like I said, three waypoints, so I'm going to place one there. Uh, there's already one there, so I'm going to try and we'll place uh, one just there. And where's the gun? So you want to look at the angle of it. I don't know, maybe there. Okay, so you want to grab these waypoints and you want to add the offset. Now, I think the offset's 600. Um, again, it will vary depending on the terrain. Uh, so, for example, over here, I've got one here. 600 doesn't work. That has to be about 400. And I set the radius. Okay, I try. <laughs> said to myself, I'm going to make this video and not make any mistakes. And I've already made a mistake. So, off radius will stick to 200. The offset, sorry, is 600. So you can see that little the line that goes up. Uh, depending on the terrain, so I had to make this 400 because 600 was too high for the gun's range. So just keep bear that in mind, trial error. So it's 17, 15, and 16 at the waypoints. Just remember that. So let's just go add. I could just copy and paste and go through with it, but I'm not going to do that. I want to show you guys where I get it from and everything. Uh, so no, it's not uh, generic. So you go generic while... Entities. You want to give it the AA gun six or your whatever tag you call the AA gun, uh, and then you want to go right click on the while command and go add inside. Go back to generic and go switch. In switch, you want to add a case. Click on double click on the case and go to rand, which is random, and um just try. But I put 0.4, so 40%. Um, just up to you what you guys want to use, um, but that's pretty good. I find, add inside, go to actor, 
and then active fire. So this is going to be telling the um, the gun where to fire, basically. So you want the attack to be a position and the waypoint. So so the any waypoint really. So 15. Um, you want the long burst mode, and you want to click on double click on the tick and add that the main gun. So it doesn't use any other gun, just the main gun, even though it hasn't got any other ones. Um, it's just got the the main gun, but still there just in case. Uh, right click again on the case and go active uh, delay sorry and this again will vary but pretty much how long it takes from when it's done that to move on to the next one four seconds is all right so there you go we've done our first case so just going to alt c we only need two and then you'll need a default but we'll worry about that in a second everything's the same just go change the waypoint uh, so i'll change that to 17. It doesn't really matter. And default will be the first one. So whatever waypoint you put in default will be the one it starts with, um, which is 16. So every time, no matter what, it's going to go to 16 first, and then um, and then do the other waypoints. So make sure you click deviate. I don't think I did that with the these ones. No, I did. I did. I just didn't say it. Anyway, <laughs> just click deviate, and then again add a delay of four seconds. And you can't double click on default, it's just default, obviously, that's what it means. So, um, that's pretty much it, let's test this out. So, it's shot at 15, there's 16, and 17 over there. So I've just shot twice there. Again, it's all dependent on the script, on the uh, the random randomness of it, which is pretty cool. Which means each time you play, you're going to get a different different version of it. Loves number 15 for some reason. <laughs> That's alright. You can add more waypoints um, if you want. Don't have to just stick with three, it could be one, it could be two. Um, well, if you're going to do one, then there's no point doing the while command. Just add the act of fire <laughs> with a trigger. Um, That's pretty much it for that. Using offsets, while commands. We'll be using while commands. Uh, the wild command a lot more when we do the endless waves and um, the waves system as well as other things um, I'm going to start doing the tutorials just on this map here so create a bit of a scenario as well <laughs> um, while doing the tutorials so um, we'll be doing I'll set up some Germans in here when we do the the waves we'll have the Russians charging or whoever we make it um, but yeah, that's pretty much the tutorial for this, guys. You can do this for artillery units. Um, just don't do the offset for artillery units. Um, you just leave it on zero, and it will actually rotate between the waypoints, and it will fire like an artillery barrage on the different waypoints. That's pretty cool, um, especially when you have you know, three or four artillery guns firing the one time. It's pretty sick. Um, that's pretty much it for this tutorial. Um, I know I've said in the last two that I'll be doing alarm systems, and I will be doing it, um, but that'll be for a different video, a different map and stuff like that. Um, we'll focus on the main stuff like waves and first. Uh, alarms will come a bit later. Um, because, to be honest, not a lot of people do it. I do sneaky missions like that. Um, it becomes quite time-consuming. So, yeah, I will do it just shortly. <laughs> anyway, thanks for watching guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. It's nice and short. Um, I'm going to try and see if I can upload twice a week, maybe. Um, I've just got... I've upgraded my internet, so it's a lot faster and a lot better, for, especially for uploading. Um, Alright, thank you for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye guys.